Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Today I'm going to show a small update on this uh, Tesla coil set of mine. Everything is still the same, absolutely everything except for the capacitors. I now have 30 NF nanofarad on this uh, uh, spark gap. Uh, first, in the previous video, I had 10 uh, NF. I tested 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50. And 30, everything above 30, I don't see, I don't see, nor do I don't hear any difference. But uh, uh, at this point, which is 30 NF, uh, I've noticed some improvement, especially in the sound that the spark gap is making, and also the output lights are a little bit better and also this difference is even though the spark gap now is pretty small uh, it is so to light up this tube in the best way possible the sound is making is much louder than before so uh, I'm not gonna run it for long because I don't have anything to protect my ears yet and the sound is uh, yeah pretty intense when I uh, run it for a while just a few seconds I will adjust it to a bigger gap when I do that it will become much louder again and you will see much more arcing over here that I still needs to uh, um, fix and also some arcing over here so in my case in my setup 30 NF seems to be the best capacitance uh, what I think it is. Maybe it's not, but I feel that is the best in this setup because of the sound the spark gap is making and also the output, which is a little bit better now. I'm gonna run it, then I'm gonna yeah, do the lights off and do some tests with this. But like I said, I'm not gonna run it long because the sound and the ozone gas is really not good for my health. So here it goes. Yeah, it is very difficult to see in the dark through my camera if the light is better. But it is a little bit better than the previous video. Not much, but every little bit counts. I'm gonna try to adjust it. Now I'm gonna gonna do I'm gonna go for a wider spark gap. At this point I hope you can hear me because I can almost not hear myself. And these streams are pretty strong. Okay. Yeah. Like I said, sorry for the short run because the sound is really killing my ears and the ozone gas is killing my lungs. And that's not the intention of these tests. But anyway, uh, so basically. I'm happy with this now, so I'm not gonna go any further with the capacitance. I'm happy with that. They do feel slightly warm, not much. The next step will be to uh, make a uh, coil, a primary coil of, uh, yeah, let's say, 25 turns. But I'm gonna let enough space for me to test from 23 turns to 28 turns. And see how that goes. Uh, I don't have the wire for it yet, but uh, gonna see what I can go do, and hopefully have it done in a week or so. Like I said, all the net, everything is the same. These resistors are still the same value, still the same 
uh, tip uh, 3055 uh, transistor everything is the same only difference is I went from 10 nf to 30 nf which seems to be uh, seems to work uh, just a little bit better so uh, I did go any I did go high like I said but it didn't help so uh, I'm gonna stay at this 30 nf for now okie dokie hope you enjoyed it and as always thanks for watching